Sea Shepherd is back in the Vaquita Refuge, this time to undertake a very important mission. For this expedition, Sea Shepherd is teaming with some of the best marine mammal scientists in the planet who have been studying the Vaquita for years. We are trying to spot the Vaquita, take photographs and footage to show the planet that this animal is still strong and it's still fighting for survival and also to allow scientists to be able to photo identify the last remaining individuals to better track the population. For us it's a privilege to be in this expedition, try to find and track and also take pictures of one of the most endangered marine mammals in the world. As Mexican it's a big honor to be here and try to spot these animals that they are endemic from Mexico. This shouldn't be a privilege for us, like, it's something that is from Mexico, it's something that belongs here and it's raising the extinction so we should be proud of having them and we are just losing them because we don't believe they exist so we will do our best to document them, to take pictures and to show to the people that we can do something and they still have an opportunity. We went to Southwest Fisheries this morning and we loaded up what we call big eye equipment and big eyes are binoculars that have 25 power and we're able to spot marine mammals at quite a distance. So these binoculars are on their way uh, to the northern Gulf of California, which is the only place that vaquitas live. And uh, I will be going down with a team of scientists as soon as the winds are very, very calm, uh, because that's what we need to see these uh, last few individuals. The reason that this is very important is because even though we get acoustic data, um, seeing is believing for humans and we want to go out and photograph these vaquitas. We went out a year ago in September and we uh, not only saw groups of vaquitas but we saw very healthy mothers and calves and we documented for the first time that vaquitas can have a calf every single year and so it's what's needed to maintain the optimism so that we get continued um, and improved government support to try to help save Mexico's endemic mammal. Sea Shepherd has been present in the Vaquita Refuge for years now, trying to protect them from extinction by removing illegal nets from their habitat but this is the first time that we participate in an expedition to actually find vaquitas and photograph them. And that means that we don't really have the experience of finding these very, very difficult to see small animals. So, so we're actually collaborating with a lot of really good scientists and lucky to have two of the best marine mammal observers in the planet, professionals that are coming on board the Sharpie to help us, who are Chris and Juan Carlos, who will be training the crew on how to find and spot vaquitas and also how to track them so we're able to take photographs of them. The effort that's going on in the Upper Gulf of California right now to attempt to photograph and see a vaquita is critical. Um, with just a few animals expected to be alive, it would be heartwarming to see an animal. They were taken in record numbers. They destroyed the population, they brought it down to just a few animals from the 250 or so that we saw in 2008. So we have this handful of animals that we may or may not see that are constantly in danger every day of being caught and killed in gill nets. really hope we do see them alive this year. We have some acoustic evidence that they're alive and so I'm hoping their only chance is to be protected here in the upper gulf. We can't take them into captivity, we can't move them. This is their home, they need it. So please help us. <laughs>